Hi, my name is Andrew Dimmer, and I'm the creator of AutoTA. According to the College Crisis Initiative at Davidson College, of the roughly 2,000 U.S. colleges that have announced their plans for the fall, more than 800 will be either primarily or entirely online, with another about 500 planning on a hybrid model. As the U.S. continues to set a new record for the number of COVID cases each day, the 800 or so colleges that have not yet announced plans for the fall will need to start looking at online options as well. And while learning online is safer, it has some distinct disadvantages. Existing telecommunications platforms allow students and teachers to connect, but most of them are designed to have only one presenter and everyone else on mute. I spoke with Dr. Spaniolo, the chairperson of Oakland University's Department of Mathematics and Statistics, to help identify some of the shortcomings of the current online lecture system. Based on talking with Dr. Spaniolo, it's clear that it's difficult for teachers to get a sense of how engaged their classes are and if students are actually understanding the content. At in-person classes, professors can see who's coming to class and paying attention. They can also easily ask questions of the class and call on a variety of students to respond, but in most online classes, if professors are sharing their screen, they can't see students or the chat, and most students don't feel comfortable unmuting their mic to ask or answer questions. In addition, many introductory college classes have either an attendance or participation portion of the class, which is difficult to assess online. AutoTA is designed to help fix all of these issues. It's designed to foster bi-directional communication between students and teachers while on a live video lecture. It lets students raise their hand to ask questions, and it lets teachers take polls and ask questions to do check-ins for attendance and participation grades. It also generates a report for each class so teachers can view the data over time for grading. AutoTA also has a unique market position because it's designed to not compete against existing online class platforms. Instead, it's a live lecture accessory that can be used with whatever video streaming system universities already have, Zoom, WebEx, Google Meeting, etc., from any operating system or device. But enough talking about it. Let's see how it actually works. First, users create an account or log in. Everything is powered by Google Firebase, which means that we get scalability and security built in. Then, teachers can create a class and share the class code with their students however they choose, whether that be through email, Moodle, or etc. Then, students can join the class. Once the class starts, students and professors open up the class, and they can either put it in split screen with the lecture, or pop it out as an overlay for ease of use, or even open it on another device like a phone. AutoTA is designed using the material spec, so it's responsive no matter the screen or window size. To show it at scale, I've got AutoTA in different browsers the one teacher in dark mode in the upper left corners, and five student accounts, A through E. Students can raise their hand if they have a question, and it alerts the teacher. When teachers are at a point to pause and answer the question, they can acknowledge the question and invite the student to unmute their microphone and ask it. Teachers can also ask questions of the students. Teachers can pull the class and see and project live results. This could be something like, do you understand, or did you have a good weekend? By taking periodic polls throughout the lecture, teachers can get an accurate picture of student attendance and participation. Student responses then get stored in a class report for the teacher to go view later. Teachers can also ask questions to the class, where students respond privately. These could be questions like, what is the y-intercept of this equation, or what is Spanish for apple? This is great as a participation and comprehension metric to view after the class. Once all students have answered, the question automatically closes and the teacher can enter the correct answer. The auto grader will then include this data in the class report. Note that if students are absent from the keyboard, the teacher can manually close the question and it stops student submissions. This also helps with attendance tracking. Finally, teachers can view the class report and see students' attendance as a function of poll responses and question answers. Note that the unanswered questions are highlighted in orange. The class report also highlights correct and incorrect answers in green and red, respectively, to help teachers gauge, gauge student comprehension. What's next for AutoTA, you ask? I want to add multiple teachers to a single class so that TAs or student teachers can access reports and ask questions during class. I also want to add downloadable reports for easier integration with gradebooks and spreadsheets. Finally, we're going to start a public beta test with Oakland University. This will help me not only test AutoTA's features, but also measure the usage to help set up a billing model for universities. Want to try it out yourself? Feel free at autota.web.app. Thank you.